Hey guys, this is just a quick video to show you how to hook up the HDMI to your Inspire 1 RC controller using the mini HDMI onto, in this case I'm using the FlightSight Black Pearl and uh, you know the differences in between uh, what you can show on the screen. So I'm going to see if you can see it. I don't know if you can or not. However, if you notice right now I have both hooked on and this is my idea. The idea is so that I have a large screen for flying where the map is and then the OSD or the, I'm sorry the secondary screen is just to display what the screen is seeing, the, what the camera is seeing. A second operator will have a dedicated monitor for um, the pilot to be able to move the gimbal up and down or whatever you know but this is just for the pilot and so the idea is um, again it's just to be able to not have just a picture in picture but to um, be able to have the map on a large scale with all the flight data and such and then what the camera sees in front of you independently so very simple all I had to do was actually well I got an adapter to the um, HDMI port and I had it straight down so that it you know doesn't stick out and um, the gravity doesn't not that there is uh, a lot of weight on it but uh, and then from there I went to a very flexible HDMI cable which in my case is a somewhat of a long cable and then I go to a adapter that is a 90 degree adapter and again with the same intention that I don't want it to just stick out like this and then have issues with the weight of the cable or somebody bumping into it or whatever so um, once that you um, hook it up and you turn on the camera then you get to see everything you still have the, the same controls if you notice never mind the, the background shot is not so luxurious but then at least you can get to see the uh, what you see on the app and what you see on the uh, monitor and if you click under the HD app you know uh, if you go to this section right here it will give you the options of what you can and cannot show like right now I'm using metric on HDMI output if I take that out, off then you see that all these uh, parameters on the bottom which is for the height the distance the azimuth the height speed and the velocity um, they go to zero meaning that it's not going to track that if I turn it back on then that data is going to start being displayed and then if I uh, take the display OSD on HDMI output off so then now I'm only showing the screen and I'm going to put it back to on and if I take the uh, simultaneous image output to app and HDMI and I turn it off right now I'm not doing anything so so it should actually I would have expected that it would have turned it off but as you can see right now it's not doing so so I don't know if that's a bug or if it's uh, something that I'm overseeing however oh never mind so actually you can tell that whenever I turned it off I wasn't paying attention here it only displays it on the monitor but not on the app so I'm gonna go back to it and I'm gonna tell it to show it on both and now you can see that it's actually showing it on the app and on the monitor at the same time anyway hope this helps somebody and I'm gonna finish this video here because my hand is killing me